Hi everyone, we're Apeksha and Navya and this is Hostels vs. Hotel Part 2. Stay tuned to see who wins. Our third stay is the hosteler. The lobby was super clean and they had a cute pet too. Our dorm was on the second floor. The lobby and the corridor seemed like they were from a hotel. We stayed in a mixed dorm. The dorm was very clean and comfortable and we even had curtains for privacy. The washrooms were very clean. Our favorite thing about hosteler was the attached balcony. Walking in the balcony was a little hard because there was a lot of noise coming from the girls' school across the street. The first floor had two different seating spaces, two kitchens. and a nice table to work out of. The hosteler had a surprise element, the terrace, which looked lovely at night. You can see the church from here. Here's our overall rating for the hosteler. Our last stay is Hotel Arches. So this is our room in Hotel Arches. It's so cute. So it's so nice to see a bed after all the bunk beds. We have space to ourselves. It's raining pretty heavily outside. We got a bit drenched. My hair is wet. And there's space to get ready here. It was so hard to get ready in the hostel. Towels. So yeah, it's pretty good for like 2300 something per night around that price. But our view is of a wall. Not complaining. Okay, there's a place to sit here. Let's check out the washroom. So, oh my god. This feels like luxury after a hostel. Nobody else using our washroom. Yay! We have a rain shower, kind of gross, but otherwise seems decent and they've given us toiletries as well. Our friend stayed in a deluxe room which had an attached balcony to it with a nice street view. Here's our final rating for hotel arches and the winner is hotel arches. That's all for now. Like, share and subscribe. And if you'd like us to review any other hotel or hostel, let us know in the comments.